Bastila, what are you doing? Oh, hello everyone. And I just messed up my intro. Huzzah! Let's go ahead and continue on without the intro. See how well my video does. As you can see, I have traded out Candrus for Jolie. Why? Because I felt like it. And also Bastila can't get her hands off of me. For once, I'm not complaining. This old guy, I am complaining. Uh, Carf, you lead the yeah. charge. Okay, so I guess I have to tell you what we're going to do. We're going to now figure out how to get into the Sith base because there's nothing really left to do. Uh, well, we still got the racing, but that'll be for later. Yeah, there's nothing to show there. I'll show... I don't know. I'll even show the racing. Nothing that important. So, you're the one Roland has got to help us interrogate this prisoner. I hope your Jedi powers will come in useful. This one has been most resistant. He's a Sith spy we picked up a little while ago, snooping around outside trying to get in. We thought he was suspicious and brought him inside when the Cellcath weren't looking. But it seems the Sith have done a pretty good job of conditioning this guy, and we haven't been able to break him yet. What did they do to him? Condition him? They must have used a lot of it. It must have been so expensive and all that goop everywhere. Oh. The Sith protect their really important spies with some sort of mental force feedback system. Oh, that they kind of condition. They turn their minds in on themselves so force compulsions won't affect them. Combine this with conventional training to resist interrogation and sometimes it takes months to get them to tell what they know. Do you want to interrogate him now? We don't have months. I don't want this LP to last that long. Just imagine that. Episode after episode. Each one labeled the same thing. Trying to break the guy. Trying to break the guy. Trying to break that guy. I'm going to kill this guy if he doesn't break. But we'll go ahead and do that. While the training the Sith gave him will protect him from most normal interrogation techniques, and also from forced persuasion, we have found a few hooks you might find useful. He was with another man when he was first spotted. We think it was another spy, but we didn't manage to catch him. We also seized some personal documents he had on him when he was captured. It would seem that he's married to a woman named Tila. We checked this in our computers, and it seems to hold up. We've sent a couple of agents to investigate, but it may be a while. Let's get started. Okay, but you should know what we have to work with here first. What we have no, here I don't is want your to. standard issue truth serum. It should make him spill his guts in no time. But there is a catch. There's always a catch, and if you're saying it's going to make him spill his guts in no time, then why are you just saying it's going to take months? It's no time, months? I would hate to see what a long time is. Because of his conditioning, he's able to resist it at small doses. But if you give him too much, his body realizes what you're trying to do and shuts his mind down completely. If you do that, you'll have to inject him with an antidote that neutralizes the truth, sir. Unfortunately, that too has a drawback. I detect a pattern here, don't you, Candrus? It causes short-term memory loss. This may work to your advantage because you can try the same tactic over and over again. But if you use it too much, you may forget everything we want to know. Shall we get it started then? Let's get it started. Yeah. Hey you, wake up. Someone wants to talk to you. Ugh. Let's interrogate him. Where is she? Boy, that wasn't even the best want. impression. She. Okay. You're not. <laughs> you lies. You work for the Republic. You're gonna be a lock in the pad itself forever. The Sith will never trust you again, Spy. We're the only place you have left. Tell us what we want to know. But they... they wouldn't. Would they? I can make it worth your while. Where is she? Ha, worth my while. The Sith don't pay very well, but they'd kill me. Let's try something else. Oh, what do you want? We know about your companion. What? What companion? Where is she? If you don't tell us, he will suffer. But he... I, I, okay, that was weird. We'll give him to the Sith. No, we'll give you to the Sith, but keep him. Of course, they would never believe we let you go so easily, but they would all too happily believe you betrayed them. No, never. Damn, 
blanked out. Okay, so my bad Batman impressions didn't help. Ugh. I'm just messing around here. I actually know what, what to do. What do you Go straight to Tila. Tila? How did you find out about her? We have her. She may be spared if you talk. She may be. No. Please don't hurt her. Please. Where is she? Sorry, I had to. No, please don't hurt her. Please. What? What? Okay, I'm not even reading about this. Um. Your companion already told us. The gutless Sith worm is already starting to crack. We'll have what we need within hours. Uh, no. Never. Damn. We blanked out. Okay, let's try this again. Interrogate. Let's tell him about um Tila again. We can make it easy. Yes. It could be so much easier. Okay, let's be really Boy. nice to him. Now you're the fracking you. We're the only ones who can take you in. The Sith will never trust you again, spy. We're the only place you have left. Tell us what we want to know. Never. I am s We can make it worth your while. Ha. <laughs> worth my while. The Sith don't pay very well, but they'd kill me. Don't make me hurt you. I'm getting bored. <laughs> no. Never. Damn. We blanked out. Blanked out. <sighs> okay, let's what? keep on going with this until we actually get what? the right combination. Don't tell us you'll suffer. Nothing you could do to us would make us talk. We Sith are stronger than you give us credit for. Huzzah! Of course, they would never believe we let you go so easily. But they would all too happily believe you betrayed them. You can't do this to me. They would kill me in ways too horrible for you to imagine. It's time to break. Boy, what do you want? Tell them about Tila. Tila? How did you find out about her? We have her. You may be spared if you talk. We already All went right. over that. All right. I'll tell you what you want to know. What's the passcode to the Sith base? It's... It's Zeta 2456981 Alpha. Just no more. Good. With this pass, you should be able to get into the Sith base without trouble. Just don't delay too long, or they might learn that he's been captured. WHERE IS SHE?! Oh, didn't care. Oh, it's over. What was I even trying to say? Oh, yeah, interrogation is over. But, we have another way to take care of that. After done blowing out your ears, we're gonna take a nice server. Really. We're gonna go ahead and crack the code. So, let's go ahead and see how hard this is. Okay, so sequence 1, 2, 4, 7, 11, 16, and next one will be 22, because it's going up. Alright, 21, 18, 16, 15, 15, 16, the next one will be 18. I am not cheating. 1, 2, 4, 8, 16, 32, the next one would be my favorite number 64 okay maybe not my favorite number it's five but that's why many by five for crying out loud I guess that's my second favorite number 28 64 32 16 8 4 that would be two One thirty two eighty one sixty four twenty five six one zero eight three or is it ten eighty three? Um oh I don't even know. Seven Yay. Log off. So that's how you do that. I didn't get experience for that. Really? 
Whatever, we got plenty of time now. We still got third way, but we can go over the swoop tracks quickly and go ahead and have a look what's over there. I'll just I'll do the swooping off the screen because yeah, I don't like doing it on screen because the frame rate's not good enough. So, Vastil, I heard a rumor that the Vulcars captured you without much of a struggle. It must be embarrassing to be bested by a handful of street thugs. There were extenuating circumstances, and I can assure you, it took far more than a handful of Vulcars to subdue me. Yeah, I'm sure there were 20 of them. I mean, 50, no, a like, oh, hundred! Whatever you say. All I know is that if we had more Jedi like Bastila fighting against us in the Mandalorian Wars, my side might not have lost. Bold talk from a broken down mercenary who is serving at Davik's heel. I'd call you his pet cat hound. But they have enough loyalty not to turn on their masters. Insults? Maybe if your master had trained your lightsaber to be as quick as your tongue, you could have escaped those Valkyrs, you spoiled little Jedi princess. I was not spoiled. I was given the same training as everyone else in the Order. You <laughs> are nothing but... No, I must not do this. There is no emotion. There is peace. That's the problem with you, Jedi. Always chanting about peace and control. Never up for a good fight. Well, except for Revan, I guess. Enough, Mandalorian. I won't rise to your bait anymore. The game is over. Let us continue on with what we were doing. Yeah, let's go bet on races illegally! Oh, wait. Actually, I was really trying to do that all the way back on Terrace in, the, in Davik's place, but it didn't happen, so that's why I brought out Candrus. And I think I'll keep him, but I'm not sure. Either way, so yeah, you see in two ways how to break in. I'm going to officially break in the third way. Even though breaking in through the front way is really funny, it's not as good for experience. There's also another reason why I want to come over here. To walk over here. And talk to this person. Hey, this street is for Sith only. You gotta pay a 20 credit toll to walk down this street. Sif, you can take my credits from my cold dad hand. You talk big, but remember what we did to Taris. Maybe you're next on our list. Hmm. Jerk. Oh yeah. Bastel, get over here. Okay, okay, come on. Let me see, you can talk to them about Sif racing, Sif racing, swoop racing. I have no desire to speak to you. I know you have links to the Republic. Really? What made you guess that? My extreme love of the Republic? Every time I do something questionable, I scream out for the Republic? Or maybe because I let Sunry go even though he should be in jail? Was it one of those things that ticked you off? Oh, um, he would actually be on your victim list if you're going to assassinate people. Kind of sad, he's kind of cool. Sorry, I was stretching. Who are you? You're wearing a Sif uniform. Are you with the Sif? This is actually what I like about him. That's so cool. Don't you think the Sif might not like that? Again, that's pretty smart. Okay, I'll be going. So that's not why I came over here. Um, let's see. Let's go ahead and talk to this guy. 
Kindern der Urgeist und der Geldkrieg. Just want to ask some questions. What's bothering you? Ah, now I understand. Do you need a loan? Is there no way you could earn it? Well, I guess you better give up. I have to go. Bye. So you can give him five hundred dollars and get light side points. My character is not because why would he? That means there's more competition. Um, I'm going to go ahead and off screen it, but I think I have enough time to go ahead and take care of part three. Not part three. The third way you can break in the Sith base. But I'm going to need to cut. So I'll be right back. Okay, now we're right in front of where we had to pay the money. So. You know, to get the docking fee, fee right here. Um, let's see, right here on the map. So, now you know where I am. Let's go ahead and head over here and find the SIF transportation place. So, you yeah. know. Okay, I'm sorry. Um, let's see, it's taking a little bit longer than I was expecting, actually. Oh, well. You're just going to have to deal with me rambling doing absolutely nothing important. Oh yeah, I gotta read this. Once a galactic hub, new trade routes have rendered Terrace completely nearly obsolete. It is decaying rapidly. Well, now it's dead. So we have to head over here, actually. Come on, door. Open up. Thank you. Past the cleaning droid. And here we go. This is where we want to go. I think. Uh, I hate this part. You can't skip it. It's so pointless. Every single time you go through these doors, this comes up. Every time. Oh, hi guys! I just want to borrow your ship. I guess that's not possible at the moment because you're trying to kill me. Boy, I decided to keep Kanda. Also, something I forgot to mention about group racing here. I think it's easier here, first of all, because you're racing over a big ocean. But second of all, they don't give you the little tear things. Little, uh, I don't know what to call them. I, I call them cards, whatever. You get actual money for winning. You don't have to actually sell your cards. So, I guess that's good. Oh, that was way too easy. Am I on... That explains it. I left it on easy. Let me see. It was... I made sure it was definitely medium for... Tatooine and Kashyyyk must have been when I was going to face up against some <clears throat> oh yeah I was with the Dark Jedi on Kashyyyk that's when it switched okay so I haven't been on easy for that long let's go ahead and take it off to the unknown indeed let's go Let's -a go. And instead of a really cool cutscene, we get the loading screen. Oh, auto mapping records process in each area left. This fine capital of Karis covers most of the planet and is built over a century of prosperity. And we have entered. The Sith base. 